um, the documentary Afropunk was simply a documentary that documented the lives of black kids in the punk rock and hardcore scenes. Right. So what happens a lot of times, like when you're looking at something a decade later, people think that what they saw was a scene called Afropunk, but they saw black kids in their perspective, punk rock and hardcore scenes. Yeah. Um, now after that, because there became because we developed this network through the the film the film um so there were more opportunities for poc kids of color to come together and do shows because we found out about more of ourselves it was still in the context of the punk rock and hardcore scene um and so and now the afropunk festival mm -hmm. is pretty much an umbrella catch-all lifestyle brand for just non-stereotypical black acts. It's it's not steeped in hardcore punk rock, but the film speaks to that yeah. experience for specifically. The, for the listeners, can you explain what Afropunk, it, the movement is, or what that is? Afropunk was a documentary. Now, the festival is a commercial festival that highlights artists who are black who are doing non-stereotypical music. So anything from Janelle Monet to SZA, to Saul Williams to D'Angelo. So that's mm. separate and apart from the film that specifically highlighted the lives of black kids in hardcore and punk rock. It's interesting, and those four artists that you mentioned are arguably very close to mainstream now. Exactly. Or, or I mean, that's, I'm being, I'm mincing words. They're Absolutely. mainstream. I mean, D'Angelo on Saturday Night Live and Janelle Monet having Absolutely. a fabulous, huge new release. Saul Williams still preserves a little bit of a kind of indie mm -hmm. vibe. And essentially, none of those names are punk rock artists. Yeah. But And that's why that's, there's a distinction between the film and then what came after and what the festival represents in general, which is a, an overall, a, a very far-reaching umbrella that embraces people who are not stereotypically working in whatever hip-hop or contemporary adult R&B.